Hello, this is the second video of my ever-expanding DVD collection. So I hope you enjoy it, and here we go. The next movie is A Serious Man, and that is directed by Joel and Ethan Cohen. And this movie is about a man that... Um, is a physics professor and there's a lot of bad hap a lot of bad things are happening to him um, including his wife is leaving him for his best friend um, his brother his unemployed brother just just sleeps on the couch all day um, his kids um, don't like him and so what he does is he consults the advice of three rabbis and they give him all different um, types of advice and, um, I mean, I thought this movie was okay. It was actually nominated for an Academy Award, but, I mean, if you like Joel and Ethan Cohen's uh, type of movies, I, 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 guess, I guess you would like it, but, I mean, it's not really my favorite movie, but I, I, I think it's okay. Next DVD is Slumdog Millionaire, directed by Danny Boyle. And this was the big winner at last year's Academy Awards. Um, and it won for Best Film, Best Director. It was nominated for quite a few Academy Awards and, and won a lot of Academy Awards. Um, it's basically about, um, in Mumbai, India, a young, a young man named Jamal uh, living in the slums of India. In, in Dubai, he somehow um, gets to be on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire in India, and through all of his um, trials and tribulations in life, um, he somehow is able to answer every single question correctly. And I found this very entertaining, and it was a very good story, and um, I definitely recommend this, this movie to anyone uh, to watch it. This next DVD is called Standing in the Shadows of Motown and it was directed by uh, I believe Paul Justman and this is the story of it's a documentary um, from Motown and it was the, um, it's about a group of musicians named the Funk Brothers. And they were um, the backing musicians of basically most or all of the major Motown hits. And they're, they were still, they're still very good musicians. Um, unfortunately, some of them have passed away. But this, this documentary uh, goes through a bunch of famous uh, hits and shows their their performances and I definitely recommend this this uh, DVD next DVD is taking Woodstock um, this is directed by Ang Lee and it's based on a true story um, about a young man that um, lives near the farm on a farm where they actually um, staged the Woodstock Festival and um, he basically um, makes a lot of money because he uh, sells sells tickets and um, he actually talks to the owner of, of the farm um, and uh, the owner of the farm was uh, played by Eugene Levy and the um, star of the movie is Dimitri Martin and, um, of course, there was, there was a lot of drug use and stuff like that. So some of the scenes in the movie were kind of um, go off the deep end. But, I mean, I, I thought it was very entertaining. It was a very interesting story on how the how Woodstock became such a um, popular event. So this movie was okay. Well, it wasn't great, but, but it was very entertaining.
The next DVD is Tootsie, and this stars Dustin Hoffman, Jessica Lange, uh, Dabney Coleman, Bill Murray. Uh, this movie was uh, got Dustin Hoffman nominated for an Oscar for his for his role in this movie, and also Jessica Lange won an Oscar for uh, Best Supporting Actress for this movie. This movie is about um, Dustin Hoffman plays a actor that is constantly out of work, he's constantly unemployed, and um, he doesn't see any way that he could possibly um, gain any, any major uh, acting roles in Hollywood. So what he decides to do is he decides to dress up as a woman and see if he can, if he can get acting roles that way. And he, he ends up getting a very popular role on a uh, hospital, um, hospital uh, soap, soap opera type show. And um, the, the movie's very funny, has some sad parts in it, and um, it's, it's, it's very entertaining and it's definitely deserving of, of someone to watch it. Uh, the movie is kind of old. It's from, uh, I think, 1982 or, yeah, 1982. So it's kind of old, but it's, it's still very funny, and Dustin Hoffman does a very good job in this movie. This next DVD is Whatever Works, and this movie was directed and written by Woody Allen, and it stars Larry David, and uh, he is basically um, a man that's um, very sarcastic, he's bitter, he likes to make fun of a lot of people, and um, he basically just does whatever he wants, and um, it's kind of similar to a lot of the sarcastic roles that Woody Allen um, has done in the past. So it's kind of like Larry David doing Woody Allen, but he's still kind of Larry David also. Um, I thought this movie was okay. So some, some parts were funny, but I, I, don't, I, I don't think it was great. But, I mean, if you want, if you want some laughs and you like sarcastic humor, um, it's definitely a movie you, you, you should check out. So well, whatever works. That's the name of the movie. Next DVD is called Whip It, and this movie stars Ellen Page, um, Kristen Wiig, Drew Barrymore, um, Jimmy Fallon, and it's directed and written by Drew Barrymore. This is her first um, directorial feature, and um, it's basically about um, a woman's roller derby league. And Ellen Page plays a, a high schooler, and she um, she somehow becomes very interested in, in this roller derby league, and she actually becomes very good at it. And um, it's actually a pretty good story. I mean, it's not one of her best performances, but I mean, it's it it's kind of a nice little little comedy to watch if you really have nothing else better to do. But um, I think it's okay. Next DVD is a very good movie called The Wrestler. Um, it stars Mickey Rourke and um, Marissa Tomei and Evan Rachel Wood, directed by Darren Aronofsky. And this movie won an Oscar for the best for best actor for Mickey Rourke. So um, it's definitely a movie worth checking out. Um, he plays a washed up wrestler, um, and he. Um, he makes a comeback, and then he has, you know, um, his uh, his daughter doesn't like him anymore, and refuses to see him, and and it's it's very sad, and um, it's definitely it's definitely a very good role for for Mickey Rourke, and he was definitely deserving of, of that Oscar. Next DVD. I have for you is Yes Man and this stars Jim Carrey and it was directed by Peyton Reed and um, this this story is about a man played by Jim Carrey who uh, 
is kind of kind of is like uh, doesn't really do anything with his life, and he's he's very um, he doesn't want to. He's not a a, a risk taker. So uh, he basically um, goes to this this convention or conference or or some kind of event where this guy um, has this saying where you can you must say yes to everything in your life and you have to commit to it. So Jim Carrey commits to saying yes to every single thing in his life. And sometimes it turns out good for him and sometimes it doesn't turn out so great. And um, Jim Carrey is definitely does a lot of very good f f physical comedy in this movie. So um, if you're a fan of Jim Carrey, you should definitely check this movie out. The next DVD I have for you is called Precious. And um, this, this movie was out this year and it was nominated for quite a few Academy Awards. And it stars um, Gabourey Sidibe and Monique and Lenny Kravitz and Mariah Carey. And this movie is about a girl that's pregnant um, and she already has two children. I believe she's only supposed to be 16 years old and it's played by Gabourey Sidibe. Sidibe. Um, and her mother is very abusive and she beats her up and and uh, this actually won the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress for Monique and she was very deserving of that role as being very abusive and just a, just a really bad person and um, I just thought it was a very good it was a very sad story and um, it was a very, very good performance by I believe every actor who was in this movie and um, you'd be very impressed by this movie if, if you haven't seen it yet so it's called Precious Next DVD is another one that was nominated for uh, quite a few Academy Awards and the movie is called Up in the Air and it's from the same director of Juno um, which is uh, Jason Reitman and this movie stars George Clooney and Vera Farmiga and um, it also stars uh, Anne, Anna Kendrick and um, this m movie is about uh, downsizing and uh, it's basically uh, George Clooney um, works for a company where he goes around and and tells people that they're fired and he has these uh, these packets that, that he gives out to everyone and um, it's it's actually a, a very good movie it's funny it's it's sometimes sad when the people find out that they're gonna lose their job and they, they don't know what to do and um, so I mean it has some pretty good twists and turns in it too and George Clooney was nominated for an Academy Award, and I, I thought it was very deserving of it. And also, uh, Anna Kendrick was also nominated for an Academy Award for this movie. And, and also, and also Vera Farmiga was also nominated for an Academy Award. So I, 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 I thought it was actually a pretty good movie. The next movie is Pirate Radio. And... Um, this movie was directed by, written directed by Richard Curtis, um, who also uh, did um, Love Actually and Notting Hill. This stars um, Philip Seymour Hoffman. And um, this is actually about um, a boat in England that played a lot of music that was, um, I guess, banned by the government. And it was actually very funny and it's actually worth we're, we're checking out, so um, this is actually a very good movie to check out. Okay, um, that's all the DVDs I can show you, show you for right now. Um, I will definitely be continuing in this series, and I hope, and I hope that you uh, like this video very much, and um, see you next time. Have a good one.